Oh, uh, uh. I mean, who is Stuttering John? He's a guy. No, did who you was... say? Did you see him last night on? Uh, who fucking put that out? God damn it! Uh, Dave Saris, the guy's yeah, name. Is yeah, Dave yeah, Saris. yeah, yeah, yeah. The the reunion. So it's classic Stuttering John. I'm watching this and I'm like, this guy's an idiot. I mean, Shuli Shuli has is basically on the ropes. I mean, they're literally on the ropes. They can they can spin it. They can spin it, and they want and they where they want. They're on the ropes. Right. So, uh, so on the ropes in what way? Like like the channels hurting? Yeah, that's yeah, what you mean. Oh. Collapsing very slowly. So he still wants to believe the work from the last work so badly that he's now moving this into right. Right. Okay. So he's just yeah, well keep. Keep hoping, yeah. praying, and wishing, man. Keep putting all your energy into it. It's working great, Kevin. Here comes that <laughs> saw back. <laughs> <laughs> so instead of John, what does John do? He starts fucking karaokeing. I mean, I'm like, this. you can't make this. You couldn't teach a guy to be this dumb. I mean, I want to fucking troll stuttering John. It's fucking... So you're right. So he does it just because... Uh, Let's not forget, Kevin tried to troll Stuttering John. It was so bad at it, he ended up deciding to be friends with him instead. Right. That's how. That's how bad he sucked at it. Cause of that, right? I I think. Look, I think he'll, he, he'll only make money if he acts a buffoon. I think he thought he was being cool. I mean, he he got like twenty five Tonight Show employees together to do a reunion, <laughs> and he, this is a guy who needs a job and wants to be back in showbiz in the worst way. And instead of being yeah, Liam gets it, Liam, and, Liam and it will be the worst way if he does get back. <laughs> but Liam gets it. He he knows what he's talking about. Cool and like kind of like putting on a good event. He got fucking hammered and started singing Roadhouse Blues <sighs> and like making the band do call and response. Like I can't think of a worse way to run a career. Uh look at me. I'm doing I'm doing a, I'm doing a Uncle Rico now. Huh? <laughs> I'm doing Uncle Rico now. Welcome. Yeah. Yeah. It's, sorry, the host wasn't listening to a word what? you were what? saying. Sorry, much what? like much like stuttering John. Yeah. Hold on. Let me get my Take into the cold store. No. These guys are a good band. They hear it the day. Don't be very like Hopefully he doesn't steal it. Because they know I'm a cheap fuck. So no. Who's that, Levy? <laughs> I can't even do it. I, I mean, listen, I, I, understand, Singer. I understand the appeal, but I can't. Wow, wow. Yeah. Well, he lasted a whole nine seconds with that. Wow, way to yeah. go. This is where you want to go for all your stuttering John coverage right here on MLC. Do it. Let me, I can't let me lash John, out at somebody I, I owe money to. Yeah, yeah. What a dick that Levy leaving with uh, leaving me leaving me without letting me pay him. I was watching a clip. Plus, I don't know exactly what the timestamp is. When I was watching a clip, uh, I'm like, he's he's like, this is exactly what they're looking for. They might have to do an emergency show tonight. Because Maybe man. we will. CEO of Fuck You Incorporated. <laughs> That's really cool. Ooh. You have a nameplate on your yeah. desk with that? That's fucking cool, man. That should Go. say CEO of I Made Less Than John Today. Ooh. Oh, ouch. Yikes. Ouch. Oh. Might be time for an emergency show, <laughs> Kev. Because it is. So, so. You're saying that he does this because uh, because it, it creates revenue for him because people troll him. Yeah, I think he calls himself the Duke of the Dabbleverse. Yeah. Thank God Thank Liam was there. Yeah. There was some information actually got out. Uh, all right. So now next is what? John's show? Yeah, so this is John's show now. But why that was important is you're going to see John's anger at both Kevin and Liam unfold over oh, this package oh. and the Ooh. next one. Well, now here's my theory. Is he really upset at what Liam said, or is he upset that he sees now Liam and Kevin are just the two of them on the show? Yeah, and John, yeah. of course, is wow. there going, that should be me. How is that Damn. not yeah. me? He's watching an X right now. So he doesn't love Kevin anymore? Oh, he you loves like, him. Okay. I don't know. Let's find out. Yeah. 
Hey, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. how are you? Uh, Welcome to the Stuttering John podcast. So, um, yeah, a lot to talk about today. Start a little early. I said, uh, fuck it. Fucking, I got, I got so pissed off by watching that fucking, that fat fuck on Brennan's show. He's got uh, so much nerve. Name, he does have. Come on, after showing, look, if, yeah. if I had a picture like that of me up there, I right. would not come in and call anyone fat. Yep. Right. Although when you, when you went through the Levy Grande phase, you were still on stage calling people fat. I remember that. I didn't even realize I was so fucking <laughs> filled out. <laughs> Liam, fucking fat fuck. I don't know. <laughs> Uh -oh. And I'm sitting there. I, I had to call in. I was like, I had to call in. <laughs> they don't even have phone <laughs> lines. <laughs> so he, right. how did he call it? He just called Kevin's phone. Yeah. I sat there for eight hours. <laughs> People make up these narratives and they think they're real, but they're not. And they talk like they're experts. And this fat fuck Liam <laughs> starts saying, <laughs> oh, and Kevin, fuck off, Brennan. What? Uh -oh. Kevin, I know you're live. Uh -oh. Fuck off. Whoa. Now, let me just pause a second <laughs> and sing a little song. Uh, my best friend. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Happy birthday oh to you. Happy birthday, oh. dear Kevin. See, I don't give a fuck. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Wow. Scola. Oh. Happy birthday, KB. I love you. Oh. So call me a buffoon. <laughs> Why? Because I had a Tonight Show party and I held it. So clearly I we spent got to him. Over remember we were talking about how his notes were on little pieces of paper stuffed in his pockets. Well, he now has a spiral notebook. He's moving right. up in the world. Oh, right. Nice. But if you notice, if you go back, he's he's writing in Sharpie. He's not even using a pen. He's using marker. Watch this. So it's calling me a buffoon. Why? Because I had a Tonight Show party and I held it. <laughs> Look, it's all marker. And I spent Christ over a thousand dollars. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> still, still putting that sharpie to use. I see, Johnny boy. On food, bands, banners, band, bands. Yeah, well, that's more one. than one, Annette. right? <laughs> I had a lap band. And work. I'm not supposed to enjoy oh. myself. Mm. I'm, I'm. I'm not supposed to get on the stage. <laughs> <Look at him. laughs> oh my god! No, Smith, cover up. Oh, how Go back on that. Watch the trouble that, that these shirts oh. are evil. How humiliating! I'm not supposed to enjoy myself. I'm 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 not supposed to get on the stage. No, really, you're not. Kev? You're not. I'm supposed to be worried about this fucking asshole. Comedian, open micer, Dave Sarah. Well, I got news for you, Dave. You done fucked up, boy. <laughs> Levy. Grande Levy over there. That was still, yeah, that was not bad. Yeah. Wasn't good. You think you're going to fucking go there? Say hi to me. He did. Tell me your name. He did. And then start taping. He did. Yeah. Isn't that exactly what he did? 100%. At a restaurant without the permission of the patrons? Oh, you think you're going baseball? to the pool? What's that, Bob? And Major League Baseball. <laughs> right, <laughs> right. Without the express written consent of Sagebrush Cantina. <clears throat> police, I'm going to the police. Ah, of you yeah, Can't go go run can. over there, Karen. Go, uh, yeah. go, go pound your fist on the desk. Tell somebody else yeah, you. You know what John is? He's a pussy cunt. He's soft and moist, but he's a cunt, and nobody wants to fuck him. Beautiful. I love yeah. it. I agree. That's like now say it like a little louder next time. What? You want to get here? 
Yeah. Ah, go. there you oh, go. Was, uh, I have to be up there. All right, I'm sorry. Yeah. Make it louder. Yeah, like stuttering John did to Shuli. Yeah, yeah, of course. The hotel yeah, lobby, yeah. right? That that wasn't private. That's according to John. But celebrities in there, then all bets are off. Thank you, John, for acknowledging my celebrity status. By the way. Mm-hmm. Hey, people, at a, at least in California, at a restaurant without their permission. What? Hey, man, don't you think it's funny that the guy <laughs> that coined the frame, you know, coined the phrase jump the shark, coined the frame. now works for the show that jumped the shark? <laughs> hey, the man. Oh, oh. Different. He's talking about your interview when you chase Shuly through the lobby. That's what he's talking about. What he's referencing there is the lobby interview with you and Shuly. That's what the reference is there, John. You want to answer <laughs> that? Go be- ahead. Have you seen my sunglasses? <laughs> Somebody filled sure. card of film card of it out back. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? I got a little surprise for everyone. Oh, Ooh, what do you got? You're fat and you talk like a moron. Hey. Hey, What's happening, look boys? Who's there. Hey. How are you, bud? I am fantastic. What's going on with John this week? Is he doing anything? <laughs> you know, pretty quiet. quiet. Yeah, pretty hush hush. Uh, that- yeah, we're go, go ahead. I, I want to promote tomorrow, point devil point. Because you were just talking about this. Yep. Wine Mike's coming on the show. But also, Dave Sarah is going to join us on the show. Beautiful. If he's Beautiful. not in prison. Okay, <laughs> listen. There's a good chance he might be. You yeah, never you get know. Liam. Liam's really good, actually. When if people, Liam wants to when, come when on. people he's... make sense to him, he's very good on a show. That's yeah, not a bad idea. Paying, if nobody's Liam paying is... attention, it don't work. But and, and Liam is a hot topic for John, uh, as we are just getting into oh, now, he, watching he this podcast. It, it yeah. was amazing to watch. It was classic how to take John down, just nice and calm and watch him flip out. Uh, we have uh, Aldo says, release the drunk driver footage, you coward. Oh, yes. I do have footage of him getting in his car and driving away. Wow. And we all saw how hammered he was. I mean, there's yeah. no denying yeah. it. We, he had a beer in his hand the entire time. Guys, I, I talked about this on my show. He gets up on stage to sing with the band. If every person on the internet, and not every person, but thousands and thousands of people are telling you you're a drunk retard, wouldn't you just put your beer down when you get up on stage and sing with the band? It's six minutes. You just don't have your beer in your hand. And, yeah. and not only not only was he holding it, the way it was gripping it like it was a lifeline. Like he was it is like like Stallone and Cliffhanger, where you know that <laughs> right. Like, yeah, but it is a lifeline for him at this point. Like, he can't do anything without it. Every stand-up, know? too. Every time you see him do stand-up, yep. he's holding the beer. I go see stand-up comics all the time. If they're drinking, they set the drink down. Yeah. You don't yeah. have to be holding it. Yeah. You, you need uh, to move. You need to, you know what I mean? It's like, yeah. you're going to hold a fucking mic, and you're going to hold a beer. Right. You got you to gotta, you gotta sell a little bit up there, man. He's mm-hmm. just fucking standing there. He's just... You're in the way of him drinking his beer right now is the feeling you get when you go. Do you to have the video of that, Carl? I do, yeah. Now, uh, I, I was talking about the video. <laughs> come on, come on, you fuck. <laughs> Bob's like, let's see it. Wouldn't be the first time there's video of him drunk behind the wheel of a car. Uh, the other time he was didn't him. Pee. He didn't pee, so how was he drunk? That's what he was saying. He's not drunk because he never pissed. Is that why? Not the whole time he was there, he didn't pee. Well, I, I sent the uh, the conversation with the valet over to Joe. I, I don't know if you have that queued up and you want to play it. Joe, you have this? You son I, of a bitch. I, I, shut your fucking I just sent it. I just sent what? it. What? Rocky? Yeah. Oh, sorry. My friend already come. Which friend? He, uh, a short man uh, with uh, a blue, blue jacket. Mercedes. A lot, of, a lot of people left already. Like, like, like two minutes ago. Like ten minutes ago. Oh, yeah, less. Okay, yeah. yeah. I, I, I thought I lost him inside. Yeah. No, no, no. He left. Okay, yeah. He yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, gray Mercedes. Uh, in, in a Mercedes, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But like, yeah. like yeah. this high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like yeah. I fit sick. Okay. Okay. Just making sure. Yeah. 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 Make sure he leaves. Okay. Okay. No yeah. problem. He was. He was. No. He wasn't drunk, was he? No, I asked him three times if he was okay to drive. He said, "What do you think?" With his voice, what do you think? I organized this. <laughs> he has nice Mercedes. He is. <laughs> I mean, that, if there is, that is a John answer if I've ever heard one. Ever. So, a couple things here. So, the Poop on Perry is the one who sent me that video. He was the one in that video. Thank you. Shout for out. That. Poop on Perry. Great and job. So, he, the valet asked John three times if he was drunk. Uh-huh. 
So he's obviously drunk. And John's <laughs> response is, I organized this event where I've been here since the beginning drinking. How could I possibly be drunk? <laughs> right. Right. And also, how can you organize such a stellar event where the only downside was the keychain bottle openers not arriving? How can you do that drunk? It's did impossible. You, did you guys analyze the signage he put up and the way he writes his S's? Someone yes. on Dabblers Anonymous Show did an amazing job. Okay, yeah, do you have that? Look, look what we did. The boys blew up the F, S, J, and K's in his address book that he wrote. Yeah. And we put it up against the bathroom stall letters, and I think you're going to be... Uh, Dude, not surprised. Look that's at a, that's amazing. Look at that K. Who writes a K like that? I don't want to sound like John all of a sudden, but that really <laughs> is interesting, isn't it? it? Yes. Also, the gap in the top of the S mm, in yep. the in the the start to the middle, the long J on top. The J, the J's are identical. The K is identical. And that, I that, know that that S is unique because I was teaching Vince the lawyer's kids how to write S's the other day. Their own right. house. <laughs> yeah. And I was right. showing them that it's supposed to be equal on both sides. And this one's obviously <laughs> elongated across the top. So is it possible that Senator John Melendez uh -huh. put this in the bathroom at Stevie Tomatoes so that I would never be allowed into that place so he wouldn't have to see me? When we're yeah. in our neighborhood of Cape Coral, is that possible? Absolutely, absolutely. It's got to be it. Possible. It's likely. Yes. I mean, it, and it, we're it, sending it, all this information over to them. Good. Yes. Let's, gonna, let's yes. get John arrested. I want to see him in cuffs. <laughs> yeah, I want the managers going to be on Sunday. We're telling him in his chat that a manager from Stevie Tomatoes is coming on Sunday, and we've sent this information <laughs> resume. Uh, we sent the uh, the FBI all the information as well. So all law enforcement are on it. Thanks for watching that video. Hope you liked it. If you did, here's a few more you can check out. Or if you want to do a deep dive, patreon.com slash the Shuli Network. Everything we do is live. So if you're signed up to Patreon, you'll get to be a part of it with us. All right, we'll see you guys. Thanks. Bye.